personally, I think that cost has a very special mechanism that is today used to run cost actions, but the mechanism as such is very powerful to bring people together from different fields. And uh, the mechanism itself has a huge potential to be used also in other fields, be it in science policy or maybe other fields as well. And therefore, I think that the intergovernmental nature is in fact an advantage for cost uh, compared to having cost as just a tiny little part or an appendix to a major research program. In particular, from a Swiss viewpoint, I think it's important to note that Switzerland is a full member of COST and therefore can use the COST mechanism on an international as well as on, on the national level in uh, very different ways and just limited to COST actions. As an EB member, I was part of a small group of people that were responsible for steering costs on behalf of our ministers. And this was, for me personally, a very rewarding activity. I wouldn't say that it made me proud to be part of it, but it gave me a lot of satisfaction to see that cost is doing well, performing well, and that I could, with my uh, knowledge and experience, participate in this. Um, I would like to mention one event um, that was very important for me personally and for COST that was the uh, phase when COST acquired a legal personality. And to be part of this process was very interesting. I learned a lot and I think that I could provide COST, COST staff with some information from my side, helping the process, supporting the process. Cost is very important for Switzerland because uh, for the scientists, it's a great option to work on an international level in Europe or beyond to integrate all kinds of communities in their work, all kinds of groups of scientists, new communities, young scientists, scientists from other fields to work on a more uh, transdisciplinary basis. So I think for the scientists, it's a very helpful instrument and very important. On a policy level, cost is very important for Switzerland because Switzerland is a full member with all its rights and duties and therefore can have some influence in cost and can use costs on a national and on an international level according to its wishes. And compared to the position of Switzerland in uh, Horizon, in the uh, European research area, it makes a big difference whether you're a full member or you have to negotiate your way, uh, your means of participation every couple of years. Cost has, with its cost actions, a brilliant mechanism to make people meet, to make people talk to each other, even if they otherwise maybe wouldn't do so, and to integrate new communities and uh, young scientists. This is a huge potential, not only to an individual research funding program, but to all kinds of activities. And therefore, I do see a role for cost in the wider European research and innovation area because the mechanism as such is very powerful. I would say that cost is key to get research communities together in Europe and beyond, maybe even the key because the mechanism is so powerful. Different things I would like to mention. One, for example, is the moment when the ministers decided to give COST its own legal personality. This was very important for COST indeed. It had to do with survival of COST maybe even. And uh, 
it was good to see that Cost got the chance and Cost took the chance and is there stronger than ever. On a more personal level, I would say it's meeting people. It's the best memories I have come from sitting together with people, discussing with people, with scientists, with cost staff, and uh, looking at cost as an instrument, how to improve cost, but also discussing all kinds of things in, in science, technology, or other things that don't have to do with the job. I think that cost will have a brilliant future. Cost has an excellent mechanism with the cost actions. It's reaching out to uh, European scientists and beyond. It does a brilliant job and it has a huge open potential. And I do hope that also the uh, responsible people in policy making, in the uh, research and policy uh, feel in the countries as well as on the European level, do see the huge potential that cost in fact has. The cost mechanism with the cost actions connecting researchers in the fields of science and technology innovation is a very powerful mechanism. And it has always been complementary to other major programs, Horizon or other initiatives in the European research area. And I think there lies the future for cost to complement other programs with an excellent mechanism that is economically very worthwhile and very efficient. Cost is the mechanism to enable scientists and researchers to perform even better. And therefore, I think that each and every scientist should at least know that there is cost. Mm -hmm.